The word captain is ridiculous. Am I in frame? I am, aren't I? I think I am in the shot. So, um, so we're oh, talking about a little bit, huh? They can probably be turned a little bit because if you sit back, you're out. And I got nobody fly. cares about me. Okay, all right, okay. fine. I'll turn right, it. I'm just helping you out, man. Sorry. I'm gonna turn it now. Now I'm gonna turn it because you know it's my chin. Right there. Yeah. Chin time. Perfect. <laughs> so we're gonna feature me a little bit more. Nailed there it. There you go. Because it's all about me. See, and all this will probably make the video too. Just so yeah. you know, I'll probably thinner. include this. Does it make it, the white shirt makes you look thinner too? Oh yeah, yeah, white white slimming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and that's why I'm wearing black because I want to look a bit beefy. I know, <laughs> try to folk up. That makes my tiny little white arms look really good. <laughs> We're talking about boat captains, and you don't even know half the stuff that I'm even going to drop on you today. She, yeah. she knows a little bit about it, and I have some guests today. So. With me is Captain Boomies. Ahoy, ahoy! And Thale Local. You might not know him. He is primarily on Instagram. Primarily he, a lot, yeah. But he does have a YouTube channel, and we're going to give him a plug. And both of their contact information will be in the description down below of this video. So what we're talking about today is the fact that the word captain is ridiculous. <laughs> Okay. All right. Okay. All it's right. Completely ridiculous. And here's why. I have a t-shirt that says, I am the captain. Right. Now, guess what kind of credentials I have? Nothing. I have nothing. I don't even have a boater safety card. I have nothing. I'm well, grandfathered. Put that all out there. Yeah, I, have yeah. Yes, I have yeah. no voter safety card. No fear whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am so old that I should not be shot in 4K. I should be shot maybe in 720p. <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I have no credentials whatsoever. But if I am in charge of my vessel and I'm out there in the water and I'm the one operating that vessel, when the Coast Guard comes up to talk to me, or somebody tells me on the radio, what do they call me? Captain. They call me yeah, Captain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they do. That That's right. Me. Yeah, That's yeah. right. I am the Captain, because I'm the Captain. All right. And Captain Morgan, he might not even been a real Captain. You know, the guy who right. stands on a barrel, you know, I don't think, you know, we don't know. He was a Captain. Was he? Of a boat. But did he have a, co a U.S. Coast Guard <laughs> a I license? Think, I don't, I don't know if he did. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> you have... One of these, look, this is the real credentials right here. This yep. is the thing. Legit. And the one you have is, what is that called? Uh, well, it is a merchant mariner credential. I know that there's different levels. You have the- Oh, the levels. Yeah, yeah. So there's, yeah, there, there's two, I guess, real basic levels. There is a six pack or uh, OU uh, PV, which is uh, an operator of an uninspected passenger vehicle. And then the next step up from that would be a master of whether it's 25, 50, or 100 ton. So- or unlimited. Or unlimited. Ooh, we'll or, talk about that. Or, or unlimited. <laughs> there's 16. There's, there's like a few other steps One in there. One million One times. One million. Yeah. So they call it a six-pack, which I think is funny because the way I would look if I had a six-pack license would be like, a six-pack license means I'm out on the river. And you can and definitely if, drink. Right? And, and if, no, if, <laughs> if they pull me over, I just got to hand him a six-pack and he goes, go ahead, hey, Captain, carry hey, on. Hey. You know, but I don't, that's, that's old school. Yeah. Hey. Uh, this means you're allowed to have six passengers. Six passengers. That's why it's a six pack. You right. can pack the boat with six people. Now, I, as an unlicensed, uncredentialed captain, I can have my 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 big boat says I can have twelve passengers. The sticker says so. Right. So I can take eleven other people out on my boat and bomb around here all day long doing whatever, and 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 that's perfectly legal. No. Right. But you. If you charge somebody a dollar to ride on your boat, you can only have six passengers. That's 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 the line. The line is if you're for hire, yeah. So if I charge people to be on the boat, six is my limit. Once you take money for your 11 passengers to be on the boat, that's when you're illegal. So don't take money. Just accept beer, yeah, yeah, other yeah, gifts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Barter's the way to do it. Right, right. Now, I've never had 12 people. I've never had 11. I don't have 11 friends. So <laughs> yeah, that's one reason why. You beat me to the joke, man. <laughs> so, Captain Boomies. Yes. You have your credentials here. I do. And yours are different. I am a master of vessels not to exceed, uh, in this one, it says 100 gross tons, because this is my old one. I'm waiting on them to print my new one. They're a little backed up. <laughs> and your new one will be for, what, not to exceed 100? 200 gross? tons. 200 tons. Yeah. What's the biggest vessel you've operated? 
Um, captained or <laughs> managed or whatever it says in here. What is it? Master. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I've been the the captain of record okay. yep. is a good way to define yeah. it, right? Yeah. So captain of record is basically when something goes wrong, who do they yell at? <laughs> uh, so, at, or really, who does the insurance company come and attack? Right. I have my own insurance to protect myself from other people's insurance. It's weird. Anyway. What I will, what was I answering? Big, biggest vessel. Oh, biggest, biggest vessel. vessel. Oh, <laughs> biggest vessel is a 144, uh, 144 feet. feet. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And she was lovely. I, I have a, I have a 144. Uh, I have a 14 foot, four inch <laughs> boat in my yard. And uh, the, the plastic bow light sticks out just enough that it's over 40 feet. I feet. will <laughs> captain the heck out of that boat. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Yep, it's great. Happily. Yep. Um, but yeah, captain of record is a good way to explain things. The real reason to have captain as a title is for um, blame structure. Like when Titanic. Um, exactly. Right, yeah. Now, here is something funny, I think, about this. He has a sailboat that he charters out of Baltimore so people can go out for the day with their significant other or their kids, and kids ride free, don't it's, they? We're the only boat in the DMV, which is Delaware, Maryland, Virginia, um, that allow kids 12 and under to sail for free. We are also just nominated as best tourist attraction in Baltimore <laughs> and nominated as best Instagram account in Baltimore. And our one year anniversary hasn't even come yet. It's July 4th. Night. Which I hear the city's going to have fireworks for us and everything. They might. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but for you, yeah. That's why we'll do that. Look at all these people that came out for our one year anniversary. <laughs> Be sure to put that on Instagram. <laughs> yeah. um, but like, so you have a sailboat where you take people out and, yeah. and that's, that's your business. Four cruises a day. Yeah. And however, and you've done this for, you've, you've sailed for years, right? You've got a lot of experience. It's 2014. Right. So yeah. you, you've got plenty of experience doing this. But if you were to operate the water taxi in Baltimore, you couldn't do it, which is a smaller, slower. That's true, because you would you would need a at minimum of a 25-ton master for that side, I believe. Yeah, yeah. So real quick, can I explain tonnage? So, no, t okay, no. all right, I want to explain you know touch. Why? All right, it doesn't matter. It doesn't right. matter. It doesn't matter. matter. And on top of that, here's another plug. So, Captain Boomy's here has a really neat video about why you'd want to get your captain's license. And I'm going to link that up here right now, and then we'll put it in the description below. She has a really good video about it. And matter of fact, it was ironic because when I reached out to her about this video, I said, hey, here's this idea for a video I have. And she said, Huh, I just finished shooting one like that. And I'm like, really? <laughs> the planet's alive. <laughs> <laughs> and then she sent me her video, and I'm like, that's a really good video. So <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Oh, you're so nice. I like it here. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, wow, she she covered a lot of the stuff. So she she covered that in her video. So, you know, we have to give her the props for that. We're not going to talk details, because no my it. viewers, most of them have, like, 10 and 12 and 14 foot boats there i'm lucky if you all are still watching really all right so i well i i have Very organized the notes and everything i have and, and there's a pen here yes yes this is my this is my official notebook this shows up in a lot of videos or it's right there right. in a lot of videos right. like are you sure you're not a captain you seem <laughs> and i like we're, we're melding really well with all the red yeah, yeah. oh yeah speaking of that, Look at that that's where i wanted to go next yeah we are not clashing <laughs> this is what i think is really really silly about the whole captain business I have a commercial driver's license. Okay. I'm not going to show it to you all, but it, what does it say right here at the top? A Maryland commercial driver's license. Right, right. See that? It says Maryland commercial driver's license. So I have a Maryland commercial driver's license. It says that right on there. Let's take a look at your credentials here. Does this say you're a captain? Let's see. Merchner, Merchant Mariner Credential, United States of America. Merchant Mariner credential. If found, please return. Here's a bunch of your personal information here. With a great picture, by the way. Yeah, it's a fantastic yeah. picture. You want to try to look. I look like... very Mariner in this picture. Yeah. <laughs> Wish we could just take this picture and show it to the people because it's like a mug shot. <laughs> and she looks great. I mean, wow, your picture is great. I'm looking at all of this and it doesn't say anything at all about Captain here. And but on the next page is all the endorsements. 
Right. So let's see what our uh, capacity OUPV operator. That's not the word captain. That's OUPV operator. Main operator. Operator, right. Ordinary seaman wiper. I don't even want to yep. know what a wiper is, but. <laughs> I wipe our boat every single day, so it's nice and clean. All right. <laughs> what is a wiper? Right, but it is funny that I mean, that wiper right wiper comes after ordinary semen. Right. So yeah, <laughs> so we don't need to go any farther right, with that right, part. Right. <laughs> it's not extraordinary semen. Sorry, all right, <laughs> just ordinary. And then stewards department F H. So I'm it, a wonderful cook. <laughs> and the limitations are of uninspected passenger vessels as defined in 46 U S C 210142. Blah 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 blah. Nothing here says the word captain. So, right. captain is just, it's, 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 uh, for lack of a better word, and I'll put the beep in right here, it's, it really is, it's completely, it's a bullshit title. Honestly, Historic title. Yeah, but honestly, I think that there should be a title for, there should be something other than the fact that you have these to distinguish that, because some people think that when they take a boat or safety class and they have a boat, that they are automatically credentialed. Right which in a way they are, like you get your pilot's license, right, to operate a Cessna. You can't jump in a 737 and take off. Now you could, but you're going to be arrested, <laughs> right? But like once you have my credentials, like I can I can operate all of my own personal boats. I mean, how big a boat could I operate that's my own boat? I, I guess in theory, any of them, right? Yeah, I guess legally it would be anything. As long as you're not taking passengers for hire, right. you can operate, if you buy a cargo ship, I guess in theory you can run it into something. I wonder. <laughs> if we find other information on that, I'm going to link that right here or disclaimers because I don't know. Like, I wonder if there's over a certain amount of tonnage that maybe they do require. I, I can tell you what yes, these regulations yes, are. Yeah. Uh, there are regulations. They are, um, they have more to do with what size vessel has to pick up a pilot. Um, oh, that makes sense. And in a pilot. Yeah, so it's going to have to do with tonnage, with length, with all kinds of things. But the more important thing is your insurance company. Your insurance company is going to dictate a lot more about what you, gotta, you gotta, need wow. <laughs> in order to have the vessel that you have. That being said, I've known um, captains that were being paid to manage somebody's boat and are on the insurance but do not actually have those credentials. This piece of paper. Yeah. Right. Um, and I know that's a big no-no because obviously with the Coast Guard. Well, no, it's not because if oh. you are, if it's essentially like if you and your friend go out boating together, you know, you could be paying him to do your lawn. Gotcha. So it's, <laughs> it's, a, it's a gray area it's loophole gray area. then. Right. Yeah. The very first license you get, you have to have done 360 documentable days on the water. So... We were talking about this once before. So the oh. first thing you can get to work on the water is a Twic card. Is that correct? Yes. yes. And that's basically just, oh, look, he's got his right there. Make sure. Yeah, there's nothing. Yeah. <laughs> a transportation workers identification card. Right. Um, so anyone working on any dock within the United States will have a Twic, whether it's a truck driver coming in uh, to get intermodal containers off of a port or it's someone that works at the port or a boat captain. You have right. to have a Twic. Both of you represent different aspects of why it's actually cool to get these credentials, I think. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, you get to go out sailing all day long with guests that you charge to take out for rides. And they're probably having the time of their life. And yeah. that get, guy gets to be your business, which, you know, for better or for worse, it's your business. Because I know it comes with its own headaches and it's hard. Yeah. But but that's awesome. Again, nominated Best Tourist Attraction of Baltimore 2023. <laughs> <but>. That's right. <laughs> And rightfully so. Then the other great thing, Captain Boomies gets to, if you've seen any of her short videos, she, she doesn't share much of this, but she gets to pilot brand new boats that come in. Right? Amazing and we can, we, boats. We can talk about this, right? Yes, yeah. yes, we can talk about so, Pretty, pretty, pretty boats. Yeah. So like whenever the people who watch those channels with all of the big fancy exotic boats, when those things get delivered from where they're built, like in Italy... And they're delivered on a ship and they're lowered into the water and brought into the marina to be, you know, checked out and, and cleaned up and prepared for the person who bought it. She gets to be the first one at the helm, peeling the plastic <laughs> off of the displays. How cool is that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's really neat. It's satisfying. It's really neat. It's like, oh, so good. Mm, yeah, you yeah, get to enjoy yeah. all of the new boat <laughs> smell before anybody else does. 
<laughs> and, and you get paid to do it. And I get paid. That is awesome. Yeah. That is. I know. <laughs> that is, that's that a dream. Is, that's that awesome. Is, that is. These are beautiful boats. They dock at the terminal right next to where our boat is. <laughs> and so every time we take a charter in or out, I'm looking at these brand new beautiful boats on a boat. And I'm like, which one does she get to drive to death? You know? Yep. I mean, millions of dollars, some of them. Oh, yeah. Easily. Wow. Easily millions. The worst dollars. part of the job is like, it, now, granted, it's not as hard as it is the pilots who are doing it out in the bay. Sure. But it's climbing off that one boat up on the ladder to get into the other boat. That's got to be your down. That's got to be getting on and off the ship yeah. requires you to usually go up a big gangway and then climb ladders just to get up to the platform where they have strapped down the boat that I'm going to be driving. Right. Um, and then, of course, the people on the Internet yelling at me for calling it driving. That's a boat, right. But like, yeah. right. <laughs> like, oh, you like, con a vessel. You don't drive a boat. You con a vessel. Yeah. What do you do with a vessel? <laughs> you con it. You don't even know. Yeah. yeah. Cod a vessel. Con. Like, con. Like, uh, con. Con. Like, uh, yeah. con. Take oh, the con. Control. Yes. Or whatever. Oh. Yes. Like, yeah. yeah, so that's where that comes from. Yes. Oh, I it's drive fun. my boat. Yeah. yeah. It makes sense. <laughs> it's so funny. I love, I yeah. love the Internet. <laughs> Yeah, the internet's great. So we can, we've learned today, we can drive our boats. Yes. It's okay because somebody with very high credentials says it's okay. And like little baby credentials, really. We can all call ourselves, <laughs> Captain. Well, you have more credentials than he does. Yeah. And you have way more than me. Look, here's my credentials right here, laid down in front of me on the table. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It would be nice, though, just to say that although Captain might be a weird term, yeah. that knowledge is amazing power. And the knowledge that you get with being a mariner or getting a mariner, a uh, hardship mariner credential, is the knowledge to protect and save lives. And I, I just think that, as weird as it is that we have these red things and we need these red things, I just think the most knowledge, the more knowledge people get about boating and stuff, just the safer everybody is. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. I think that's that was, that was a nice public service announcement yeah, that you yeah. did there's, there. There's your PSA. For yeah, today. I appreciate that. It was good. That was good. And you kept it short enough where we didn't have to all tune out. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But if, if you are planning on taking your safe boat or anything like that, go watch some of my videos. I've got some yes. really good tips to get you through it. It's way easier. <laughs> and she also has something called the Funny Boat Podcast. That's which awesome. I, I really enjoy, and I was on there, and... You're going to. Yeah, we're going to. Yeah, we just did that last night. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, please be sure to check that out as well. I'm going to have a lot of things i got to put in the description here, all these links, all this stuff here or whatever. So... Thank you guys for coming and talking to me today Absolutely. and hanging out at the at the beach on this hazy, <laughs> hazy, hazy day, but yet comfortable day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not too hot. So, yep. Thank you so much. And here's the next video you should watch next. I'm going to put it right up here. It might be over their faces. I'm not sure, but that's where it's going to be. Thanks so much for watching. Stay safe on the water. <laughs> You're the best. That's great. <laughs>